Welcome back to another episode with me, Bellfire, and today I'm joined by Caleb, and we may or may not have boosted and yet downgraded the ME system. Yeah, that's fair. Because we added more crystal growth accelerators, but at the same time, we upped the power requirement so much that we need to make another energy acceptor. Oh, my warp is actually doing stuff again. Oh, uh, wow, it's been a while. Yeah, keep in mind, Infusion Provider is a, um, it's a warp research. Ah. I just haven't gotten a warp in a while, that's why it hasn't triggered. Thankfully, Good. it was one that doesn't actually do anything, but still. What does it do? Um, it was, um, what was that noise? Something was behind, something is behind you. Oh, paranoia or something like that? Uh, no, it does literally nothing. It's just there to freak you out. Like, as a player. Yeah, paranoia. I mean, I guess, yeah. But if you've been playing Thonecraft for long enough, it really just doesn't bother you. Yeah. At all. Um, okay, so I have another quartz. What do we need for quartz glass again? Um, it's four five glass, quartz. five quartz dust. Let me go check to see if we have glass. We do. Also, as you guys see, I can access now access the ME system without having the ME, the wireless crafting terminal in my hand because it's in my bobble slot. Also, I'm just going to say, I keep forgetting that I have to do, like, all of this crafting in the arcane <laughs> workbench. Just bring it down here. Well, I'm not going to need to, because we're about to have an ar arcane crafting terminal. Good point. Well, we already have it. I'm just trying to figure out if I can put it in my thing first. But, and, uh... Okay, now I just need quartz glass and an engineering processor for... The 16k storage research. Oh, great. God, this is... <laughs> and we have the second energy acceptor. Uh, Only problem is, we don't have any more VIS generators. I can make some. I'm pretty sure they're cheap. We can also just repur repurpose some of them for now. Like the charger one, maybe? Yeah. That is what I was thinking of. 1.5, please go up. I'm actually going to check how much this we have. That's actually a good shout, because we're using more now than we were beforehand. <sighs> we're not doing good. Right, 75? More theories. I think it's balanced out for now. Eh, good enough, I guess. The power, at least. Yeah. So I'm going to get more bone meal, which I stuck all of it into the ME system. So you said we're not doing well on... Flux, Viz, yeah. Ooh, yeah, we're losing a lot of his. 74 was when, is what it was at when I checked. Yeah, still what it's on, but that's not exactly good. No, it's not. Also, unfortunately, I cannot put the arcane crafting terminal into the wireless crafting terminal. Yay! But hey, we do still have an arcane crafting terminal. That's good, at least. So I can do the stuff over here if I need to. I really wish I could put it in my thing, but I'm pretty sure only the applied energistics, um, like the original ones, you can put in the wireless crafting terminal. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, Caleb, remember how you said you wanted to make a Taint Island, right? I... still not what I said. 
That's what I interpreted. I, I won an island for Flux Rift. It's not necessarily going to get tainted. It probably is, but we don't know for certain. That's right. Well, uh, off camera, I converted a slime island into a cobblestone island. So now we have it. Oh yeah. Also, if you need material for to turn into flux, let's just say I have plenty of silver wood. <laughs> yeah, checks. I mean, if you want to come and see, I doubt you would be surprised. Yeah, I know how much I know how much wood you get from them. So I'll throw them in the chest. Throw all the wood in the chest with the black hole talismans. Okay. You know where that is, right? Yep. Okay. I have to ask because I don't think Nick knows, and I'm pretty sure Puzzoop doesn't know. Okay. Oh, by the way, um, just to confirm, you have no spare quartz glass, correct? Correct. Okay. But there is pl plenty of spare quartz in the Emmy system. Okay, got it. It should last for a little bit, it, but it probably won't last for long. We'll see. I mean, I need one quartz glass, so... Oh. Yeah, I need it for the research. Okay. Well, I'm planting more trees. Uh, that was painful. What, did you finally make 116k? Yep. Finally have a one. Is there automated crafting pieces? What do you mean? Like, is there something you can use to automate the crafting of... Uh... Digicentia? Um, well, Digicentia is just, I'm pretty sure it's, by the way, there's a shooting star. Yes. I'm going to follow that real quick. Okay, why? I have no idea why it does. Sure they, I'm pretty sure it's like an actual astral thing, and it does land, and it just drops something on the ground where it lands. Oh. That's cool. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. It's an actual thing. I don't know how up in how high up in the sky this is, but I'm gonna continue going up. Well, I no longer see it. I'm on the same Y level as it now. Four hundred. Oh boy. It's going down though. Very slowly, but it is going down. Let's hope you have enough mana. Yeah, let's hope. Well, it's going down faster the longer it's going down, so. Oh, okay. Y200 already, so. Yeah, From four. Wow, that was fast. Yeah, I think it was just going pretty much exclusively horizontally and disappeared. Through. So, possibly I. Oh, never mind. There it is. It just went out of render distance. And shining casing. What the heck is that? It's the item I got from where it landed. Something is shining inside the case, right click to open. I got a lucent scroll. Strange constellation it's con constellation is drawn in the scroll. Discovering it should provide additional clues. Nanuvu. Huh? It's Okay. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm confused. Oh, well. I guess during the given constellation, or uh, given the... I guess looking at the uh, constellations at the given um, moon phases, it'll 
show me that constellation and I get free stuff. Okay. I, it's the first time I've ever tracked down a uh, shooting star. Well, that's cool at least, right? Yeah. Also, I'm going to go ahead and actually make the Digicentia thing now. Okay. Ow. A tree just smacked me in the face. Bad. And there we go. We have a 16k ME Essentia storage cell. Yay! So now we can store Digicentia. Now we just have to make three more. Pain. Yes. Uh, this is not going to be fun. No, no, it's not. It's so expensive to make. And I'm not going to bother making the 60, making even 164k. Like, even unlocking the research, I'm not doing it. Yeah. That's just way more effort than it's worth. I mean, sure, it's more Essentia, but... More Essentia storage, but... 16k is enough. It's enough for at least 1k of each type. Yeah. Yeah, uh, no, that's, that's not going to grow. Unfortunate. Okay, well. I have 82% Oromancy. There's so much of Oromancy locked behind getting a primordial, primordial ball, and I hate it. Not F2, I meant F3. And it looks like we are gaining power. It's just slow. Okay. And the Viz seems stable. As in, it's staying around a certain point? It's hovering around like 77, 78. Oh, it's going up now. Good. A bit. Because I've just... If you come take a look outside, you'll see what I've done. Yeah. Okay, so hey, at least now we know for certain that silverwood trees definitely help. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah, I've started the... How many is this? One, two, three, four, fifth? Fifth, yeah. Tower? Jeez. Everyone else is just going to question it next time they get on. Yeah, definitely. Uh, also, did you know that um, people discovered a new way to break bedrock? Oh dear, how? It's like some piston thing where basically what it does, obviously I haven't ever had, an, had it explained to me, but from what I can tell what it does is it pushes a piston down, which pushes bedrock one block into the void, which deletes the block. Oh. Yeah. Is that even legal? Because isn't Bedrock an immovable block? Um, it's some TNT thing where it's like it's ah. like TNT in a trap door, and there's something that you can do that basically just pushes the piston down, which pushes the Bedrock out of the way, which just deletes it, because obviously if a block is in the void, it gets deleted no matter what it is. Mm-hmm. So. But hey, trees. Yeah, trees. Also, why do we have so much red Portuguese pavement? On the floor? Yeah. I've accidentally made extra and I've been too lazy to dig it up. Fair enough. Well, when I've needed it, I've been too lazy to dig it up. Yeah, that's fair. So I just made more. But yeah, we're gaining energy right now, so. That's good. That's good, yeah. Also, How... I'm going to head over to the Taint Island. Yes, I named it the Taint Island. Yeah, I'm going to... I will join you. I'm going to grab some hoppers real quick. And don't forget the Silverwood. 
Uh, yep. Let me just make the hoppers before I forget. Well, I'll grab the silver wood. Okay. I'll grab part of the silver wood. There's a lot of silver wood. Okay, I got hoppers. I have a hungry chest. Oh, can you bring in the ender chest? Like one of the better ender chests? We'd have to make it. Okay. And they aren't the most fun to make. <laughs> I'll grab the... Can I see this over? Actually, oh, it's still in here. Okay. Um... So, um, is this all of the silver wood? No, I have most of it in my inventory. Okay. Basically, I don't know if it's enough Essentia. Because it needs to be like 20 to 30k. Well, if we need... Blocks, but I'm pretty sure it's one for one. So. If we need extra, we can always use the will of Krail, Varek... Well... Sure. No, we should not use the will of Krail because it has uh Vic Vic what was it? Mortis, Pigmentation. All of them have the same one. Oh no wait. Vitum. Vidium? Vidium, yes. Uh why is that not all good? We shouldn't use it because that's the main way I make corrupted essence. Oh, using the will. Oh, that's what you you. That's so much extra essential. I know, I know. Hold on, let me let me give you a better thing to use right now. Give me a second. So to create a spawner, you need four cup ingots, which is four cup of essence. Uh, what else? So five vidium. It covers the Vidium and, I believe, Spiritus. Two of them. Three of them. Uh, let's see here. Oh, uh, Nether Wart is a good alternative. Er, to be fair, what? in small amounts it's better, but in big amounts, the will might be better. Oh. To be fair, the best thing for Vidium is... Like tainted blocks. Oh yeah, definitely. But obviously, we don't. Do well, we can get access to those. Exactly. But I just don't feel like it. <laughs> so I will meet you at the taint island. Okay. So wait, how much? So how many silver wood logs do you have? Uh, one, two, three. F oh, my! An entire row of nine. So nine. Times nine times sixty-four. Times twenty-five is fourteen thousand. Is also that how much you need? You need more. I need twenty to thirty thousand. Oh boy. And this is only fourteen thousand. Oh dear. So. What else has, like, a lot of Essentia? I mean, a lot of Botania items have just ridiculous amounts of Essentia. Use use a good amount of the wills. We have plenty of them. Uh, those are 40 each, and we don't really have enough for that to be useful. Uh, I mean, Gaia Spirits, honestly. That's, uh, like... And, I mean, they're easy enough for us to get now, so, yeah, go for it. It's, like, 50 per... So, that's 3,200 by itself. Do it. Stacks do we have. We only have, like, one stack, though. Okay. Well, we have two stacks, but I want to keep enough to where we can actually, like, use it if we need to. Okay. So let me also go ahead and claim these and chunk load them. So up to around eighteen hundred right now. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, wait, hang on. Uh, Grab the black coal talisman with cobblestone in it. How do you take the cobblestone out? Putting, put it into a crafting grid. I would just um, recommend grabbing the entire thing because we have a lot of cobblestone. Actually, mana balls might be... Eh, it's like 20. Eh, I guess just these and then a few stacks of cobblestone. Uh, yep. So you are on your way now, right? Yes, I am okay. on my way. Okay, just wanted to make sure. Yeah. Uh, do you have the ender chest? No, because we have to make it. Can, can we make that before we set this up? Sure. Because the second we throw the flux in, there's going to be a rift. So, okay, we need two obsidian, a chest, a piece of wool, and then four blaze rods. Uh, that's not too bad. Okay, so I'm on the top platform right now. Actually, bottom platform would be better for this stuff. Uh, no, because the void siphon is not going to be close enough. Never mind. Well, now we have plenty of string. There you go. Oh, wait, blaze powder. If only we had an uncrafting table. <laughs> so, where are you? I'm at the top right now. Okay. So, I am going to give you... Do you have room for all the silver wood, ro silver wood logs? Uh, yep. Okay, there they are. And then ender chest goes... I'll be right back with an ender, ender chest. Yep. Okay. Let's just hope this works the way that I'm hoping it does. <laughs> uh, I need... I almost forgot you can turn f uh, flowers into different flowers. Okay, then I need to grab two obsidian from the obsidian generator. You said blaze rods are in Nick's chest. Okay. I pressed the wrong button on the uh, black hole talisman. What? What do you mean? I shift left clicked it in my inventory. What does that do? I figured, out, I figured out how to uh, do it. Uh, if you shift right click it, it pulls all of the items possible, so it just filled my inventory with stacks of cobble. Oh, okay. Yeah, don't worry, I figured out how to put them back in. Okay. So I'm gonna call it like six stacks of cobble. Okay. I think six stacks of cobble, a stack of Gaia spirits, ten stacks of silverwood logs should be good. Okay. Oh, actually, you know what I forgot? Uh, can you bring the crucible with you when you come back? Yes, I'll bring the crucible with I me. I completely forgot about the crucible. Bravo. <laughs> Which is, like, arguably the most important part. Yeah, to making a flux rift, I would agree. Go back. Okay. So, I will be back when he's back. So, I'll see you guys then. Okay, I'm back. And... Purple, purple, purple. Purple, purple. Purple. Dang it! So close. Where are you? I am on my way. I'm just setting up a custom channel. Okay. For the chests. 
Yeah, I'm just going to kill all these mobs while you're doing that. Extra Essentia! Yeah, because I'm not actually going to use any of those for Essentia. Okay. Your chest will be over by your setup. Okay. Or will be in your setup. Okay, thank you. And I almost forgot the Crucible. <laughs> See, it's not just me. I'm not the only dumb one here. Well. Forgetful. I know what I said. I know. I'm not dumb. I'm, for I'm forgetful. I know what I said. Okay. Only if Horologium was up tonight. <laughs> uh, the thing that I need should be up in, I believe, two nights. Okay. Three nights, sorry. So where do you want me to put the Crucible to be safe? Um, probably lower area. Like? Because it needs to be in the same chunk. It doesn't need to be, like, same location. Okay. And then... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna chunk load these six chunks. Already done. Okay. So it's this chunk here. Well, uh, hey, could I... How... Could I have the black hole talisman full of cobblestone? Uh, just let me kill those mobs first. And there you go. Don't forget to put the ender chest down. <laughs> yep. I now need the netherrack. Wrong spell. I left it on flame. Don't know why it insists on changing. I got it. Thank you. And then, boom. Okay, now that so should be linked. And we don't want to leave any gaps. And hopefully, this won't spawn flux and this won't spawn rift in the wrong area. Hopefully. Okay, are you ready? Yep. Let me get my causality collapse out real quick. Actually, no, I'm gonna leave it in my backpack so I don't accidentally throw it in. Okay. Smart. Y you ready? Yes. Wait. Me, yes, I am. Your, get your thermometer out and just stare at the. Uh, there's okay. So much okay. <laughs> Five thousand three hundred and a ten. Oh, that's not. That's nowhere near the amount that I wanted. That's not. No, I wanted like twenty thousand. Well, oh, here. Oh, oh, that is a pretty big rift. Well, that's upsetting. Well, uh, hey, guess what? Whoa. Oh, I got rid of the void site. Okay. Oh, and we already had a taint seed. How do you feel about, um, 66,000? 66,000? Oh, that's how much we have now? No, that's 6,600. My bad. Well, I didn't get the thing, so I need a new Kazali Collapser. By the way, it's already tainted. What? Yeah, Taint Seed already spawned. Oh, dear. Yeah. And also, I need to make a new Void Siphon now. Because it actually can get rid of Void Siphons. Hey, 10,000! Hey. Yeah, 
so I guess just leave this junk to do whatever. Well, I'm going to get you up to that 20,000. Okay. Also, I finally got my research for teeth seeds. Nice. Fifteen. Ooh, we're getting closer. Uh, let me check the recipe for causality collapses again. By the way, we're probably gonna wanna unchunk load these. All of them. Yeah, because since I can't do the uh, Void Siphon thing... Okay. Yeah. I'll do that as soon as I get to 20k. It won't let me do it for some reason. Twenty K. Oh, it's because I was pressing the wrong button. There we go. You now have twenty K flux in the air. Holy <laughs> Yeah. That's massive. Dear Lord. Yeah. So I need to, yeah, just unchunk load the things. Done. Okay. Yep. Cool. Okay, and I'm back. Flux Rift, also known as the only thing that can bypass claim protection. Yeah. So well, void siphon. that's a ma yeah, that is a massive one. Yeah, but I'm I don't think that's even max size. I didn't spawn when it had 20k blocks. Oh dear. Yeah. Uh, let me grab. Do you want to get back to what you were saying? Yeah, unfortunately, we're out of time for this episode. So I hope you'll enjoyed. Please don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, share all of that amazing stuff, and I will see all of you in the next episode. Bye, guys!